Hello and welcome to the vlog. This is number four and number five, a hunting piece in lead or Jagdstück in lead. Starting with number four, the hunting piece. It says at the top, simply half notes. And that's because we have already gone through four, four time, three, four time, and all four strings. Now we're going to look at how to maintain a even steady bow and use the same amount of bow for both down and up bows on these two strings. The dynamic is forte throughout the entire piece, so the student doesn't have to worry too much about altering the sound. Now on to a short demonstration of the teacher's part. Nice dotted rhythms. So there you go, dotted rhythms and also bows that are held over two beats just like the students. Please enjoy the hunting piece. All right, now for a little more technically speaking for number five. It says at the top, use of the first and second fingers. It's useful to tap before you begin so that you know where the finger goes and how you're going to use it. Make sure that the bow is free and uses the same amount as you did on the open strings. It's also very useful to check your intonation and use of bow by playing stopped bows. You get a good sense of how to use your fingers in the left hand, and then you can do a detaché. And check the D string as well. Make sure you have the right amount of bow and the fingers are in the right position. Now for the teacher's part. You can see it's slurred, it's arpeggiated, and they are two beats to each bow. And as before, the teacher changes the bow most generally with the student. Now it's time for number five, Lied, the song. I hope you enjoy. 